This is something else, comics. for the elect, three times for the elect, all praise BTI, all beautiful praises BTI, all magnificent praises BTI, the most high yeah, may his name be magnified forever, Buru Kaba by Shem Yahuwah, ladies and gentlemen, I'm coming back with another live stream, yes indeed, uh, it's been a minute since I've been on here talking y'all, I've been having uh, some affairs to take care of, but you know, here I am. So, ladies and gentlemen, I really have nothing in particular to talk about because I'm really just, you know, setting up my equipment and, you know, learning and stuff like that. And, you know, <clears throat> in the midst of me, uh, doing my tasks and all that type of stuff right there right you know I couldn't help but to think and just wonder in awe of the untapped potential that each and every one of us have ladies and gentlemen Yes, indeed. See, ladies and gentlemen, you know, now that I think about it, I'm going to make this live stream about potential. Yes, ladies and gentlemen. I got to do it. Hold on one second. So lucky you. One second, one second. One second. But, uh, my bad, y'all. My bad. Yeah, I'm gonna make this this live stream about potential, ladies and gentlemen. Because in the past, I would say six months for me. For the past six months, it's been a journey of discovery, you know. Well, you know, this walk, the narrow path, you know what I'm saying? The journey on the narrow path is, you know, a journey of discovery, right? But see, what I mean, you know, what I mean by discovery is discovery of myself more things getting to know more things about myself as a person you know what I'm saying coming in tune becoming in tune with my own individuality see ladies and gentlemen when when we become in tune with our individuality 
with our own individuality wholeheartedly then that right there is transmuted into an energy and it unlocks the potential that we always had within us but we never knew we had it because it lied, lies dormant you know what I'm saying see ladies and gentlemen y'all got talents abilities you know gifts that she don't even know you even have yet you know what I'm saying but see things become unlocked you know what I'm saying as we grow as we elevate as we evolve right in it you know in the Holy Spirit you know what I'm saying you know these things become become unlocked you know these are these are what, what, what they used to call God given gifts yes it's a real thing ladies and gentlemen God given gifts is a real thing make no mistake about it you know and see you know these things these things are bestowed upon each and every person you know what I'm saying that that dwells upon the shadow of the almighty you know what I'm saying you know these things be bestowed upon people because the you know, it's a part of one of the promises, you know, that uh, the Mashiach had gave us back in the day, you know. Uh, what, 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 what did he say? Um, seek, seek him in all of his righteousness and all things to be added on to you, which I think that scripture meant. All these things to be added on to you. You know, gifts, abundance, abilities. You know what I'm saying? See, he gives you the gifts to get the abundance. And he gives you the abilities to be able to have the abundance, hold it, and expand it. Y'all get what I'm coming? You feel me knocking? <laughs> well, let me in. <laughs> I'm just saying, you know, I ain't the smartest man in the world. But, you know, it don't take a rocket scientist to be able to see and understand that the Almighty gives to those who patiently wait for Him, pay, patiently seek Him. You know what I'm saying? See, you know, see, you know. I'm 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 very diverse when it comes to you know uh reality. I'm just going to say reality, right? I'm just going to say reality. I'm real diverse when it comes to reality, ladies and gentlemen. Because when I look at things, I look at things from very different angles, you know, like a diamond. See, because I learned, I, I grew to learn that these things are necessary. You know, it's necessary to look at everything from different angles, from different perspectives, to actually get a better understanding of what you are looking at. Ladies and gentlemen, that's a jewel right there. Okay. So, you know, these things, you know, I mean, you know, see, 
And before I go on, I'm going to say this. Before I go on, I'm going to say this right here. It's easier said than done. You know what I'm saying? Because just like all good things, it's a process. Nothing good comes quick. Don't nothing come too fast but a crash. And anything that do comes to a person that looks on the outside to be good is not really good because that person had to do something that goes against that person's own code of conduct or whatever the case may be to obtain these things. So it came with a dirty price. But I'm not trying to go there. I just said that, right? I'm not trying to go there. Boy, all I'm trying to say is, ladies and gentlemen, is that we are divine creations that w- that was manifested from the mind of a supreme being right let me just paint this picture let me just paint this picture for y'all real fast we are a divine creation that was manifested from the mind of the supreme being right so this is where we have to think big this is where we have to think colossal we can't think small when it comes to to these type of topics right here right so by us being divine manifestations of the supreme creator right don't y'all think the supreme creator would would create a creation that match his tastes think about it match his you know what i'm saying his his uh his expectations think about it See, I'm not talking about right now because because we fail. We have failed from divine grace. You know what I'm saying? We have we we haven't failed from grace, but we fail from divine grace meaning and e- eternal life. Put it like that. Right? So looking at it now, of course we are not going to see the beauty in it because we are held bounded and stagnant by by limitations that was ordained from the spiritual realm so of course are we not going to live up to the expectations that were was was set out for us right that's why we have to go on a journey, walk the narrow path. Because now, see, he made it to the point we have where we have to earn our divinity, earn our spiritual inheritance, earn our gifts, earn our abilities. Nothing comes free. Nothing. The only thing that comes free is the gospel. And really righteously, really righteously, it's so many different levels to the gospel. I can all, I can actually I can actually say that it's safe to say 
that the that the gospel that this that this that's freely given is just scratching the surface. It's basic. It is just it's just enough. It's just enough to to twist the knob on the door and open it. But it's up to you to go in. Okay. And the reason I say it's basic is because, okay, what's the gospel? The gospel is go out into the world and and tell the world that God has sent his only begotten son to die for the remissions of the sins of the people who love him. And, and those who love him will have everlasting life. That's the gospel in a nutshell. That's the gospel. That's the free gospel. It's basic. Everybody knows that the Mashiach came to die for uh, uh, for our sins Everybody knows that happened Everybody knows it I don't care what nobody say e e Even even people That don't believe in God Atheists, Satanists Everybody knows it It's basic That's why it says it's up to us It's up to us to Go through the door, walk through the door once we open it. And once we open it, then we will experience the 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 golden nuggets, the gems, the jewels that we find in 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 fields. Now I'm 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 just supernaturally speaking right now. I'm spiritually speaking right now. You know what I'm saying? I'm speaking in parables, how the Messiah uh, used to be, you know, when, when, when he used to talk about the kingdom of heaven, he used to always refer to it as being found in an open field or just being it just being found somewhere. Okay. So these things that's being found are things of the kingdom. Things of the spirit, whether it be wisdom, knowledge, and understanding, whether it be uh, 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 hidden talents and abilities, wh whether whether it be you know anything, whether it be a anything, bro, anything. No, I'm talking about. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. I used to I used to hear people all the time say stuff like make it make sense. I used to hear it all the time. So when you know now now that that I got a little wisdom not understanding under my belt to actually know the difference. To actually know better with the help, you know what I'm saying, of, of the Holy Spirit, I'm gonna make it make sense. Make it make all the way sense. You know? So, you know, but another thing, you know, another thing, and this is very important. Y'all gotta be careful. When 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 y'all when y'all discovering y'all selves, y'all gotta be careful. Don't die before your time. I'm gonna say that again. You have to be careful when you all are discovering yourselves. Don't die before your time. Because this is a hateful world out here. This is a hateful world, ladies and gentlemen. Full of people that just don't want nothing good for themselves. 
and no one else. This is the world we live in. So, you know, we on this journey of self-discovery, spiritual discovery, we just on on, on a journey of discovery. So when we when, when we discover, of course we going to have a, a sense of excitement. You know what I'm saying? Like a kid at a candy shop kid at a candy shop I'm just saying and you know I remember how I used to be when when I used to uh, uh, you know like get something that, I, that I've been wanting for a while or whatever the case may be man I used to be excited man I had to go te- tell a friend yeah, man, I got this. Yeah, I did that. I did that. Running my mouth. Running my mouth, ladies and gentlemen. And every time I used to do that, I used to jinx myself every time. And I'm not superstitious. I'm not superstitious. I don't believe in coincidences. But... I didn't, you know, I told my business so much <laughs> when I was younger to the point where I couldn't help but to notice a pattern. It's a pattern. I was in a pattern, a cycle. Right? So, you know. I noticed that, you know, when I have it, I, I didn't have it long or something that I, that I want to do real bad, you know, just know that I, I had it in the bag. Lost opportunities, all of that. And you want to know what I came up with? Me telling my business open up spiritual portals for monitoring spirits sabotaging spirits to monitor and sabotage me in the spiritual realm to prevent and sabotage my opportunities and that is how it goes ladies and gentlemen that's why keep your blessings and keep your your you know your 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 discoveries on the hush, keep it on the hush, because Lucifer is like a lion seeking. You know, he, he's seeking who he can destroy. Don't let the devil in, because he sure try to get in. He been trying to get in, man. I'm tell you, man. I'm trying to see, man. I'm trying to see what y'all think. I don't know. I just don't know. So yeah, but yeah, y'all, man. I'm gonna uh, wrap this up, man. Uh, I finally got my um my equipment somewhat set up to where I can use it and be comfortable while using it. So yeah. So I'm I'm satisfied with that. I'm satisfied with uh, you know, with the results. And uh um, I appreciate y'all man and y'all be safe out there man and you know, stay strong. One time for the elect. Shalom.